after their lucky escape from our clutches, the late Admiral Harkov's remaining fleet has finally been located by Lord Vader, having been constantly on the run. They are tired, critically low on supplies, with few fighters left, and have been seeking rebel aid and refuge. Lord Vader does not want to risk this fleet escaping his grasp again. He will be arriving soon with several Star Destroyers, along with a detachment from Admiral Zarin's forces. It is imperative, however, that we stop any escape attempt now before they can once again flee. So the modified frigate Osprey, along with the interdictor Harpax, has been sent in ahead of the main task force to give them time to catch up and engage the enemy fleet. You will be flying a TIE Advance designated Alpha-1, leading a full 12-ship flight squadron. A second full squadron designated Group Beta will be on standby along with several regular TIE groups from the Harpax. Your craft has also been upgraded with the new tractor beam weapon system developed by Admiral Zarin. This beam weapon allows you to hold an enemy fighter in place so it can't evade your fire. Like shields and cannons, it is tied to your energy management systems. Press the B key to use this new system and use the F8 key to alter its recharge rate. Though the Osprey is considered expendable, the Harpax is not, and above all else, you must ensure its survival. Though the enemy fleet's fighter strength has been depleted, they still have a handful of their own TIE Advance left, along with the usual complement of regular TIE Starfighters. The Victory Class Star Destroyer Protector is also quite capable of destroying both the Osprey and Harpax directly if she can get in range, along with her remaining support ships. If you can destroy their remaining fighter support, they will be easy pickings for our bombers when they arrive. It's time to put an end to these traitors, once and for all. Stay alert for new developments. We have reason to believe something is amiss, so be prepared to take the initiative when necessary. What's left of the late Admiral Harkov's fleet has once again been tracked down in orbit of a gas giant in the Otica system. Determined not to let it slip through our fingers again, Lord Vader has sent in the Interdictor Harpax along with the modified frigate Osprey to prevent their escape. These two ships alone cannot stand toe to toe with the Victory Class Star Destroyer Protector directly, so your main job will be to protect the Interdictor Harpax and eliminate any remaining Starfighter defenses their fleet can still throw at us. We don't expect there to be any significant threat from these fighters though, so this should be a relatively easy sortie to mop up what's left. However, we know they've been in contact with the Rebels, so stay sharp for any reinforcements that may show up to try and save them. Lord Vader will soon arrive along with Admiral Zarin with major reinforcements to finish off this fleet once and for all. Once Lord Vader arrives with reinforcements, our bombers will make short work of the enemy fleet. Don't forget to make use of your new tractor beam system. Press the B key to activate it and use the F8 key to alter its recharge rate. Attacking craft, dead ahead. Uh, Looks like they got them in dash for a few fighters. They're using ships designed by the Hutt. Sorry, I'm having trouble over here. You got it. Me hey, too. Need to shake that bandit off your six. Another bandit down. Oh, got it. Whoa. Woo. Wow. Woo. Got him! Great shot! Black one! Woo! Wow! Whoa! This is two! Starship has me sighted! This is three! I've got a starship firing at me! Got him! Keep it up! Whoa! This is four! I 
Large numbers of rebel fighters incoming. Alpha One, dock with the Osprey if you need to replenish your missiles. All squadrons, hold the line. The Harpax must be protected at all costs until our reinforcements arrive. Hey One, second craft dead ahead. Keep it up. Mr. 
have arrived. The tide has turned back in our favor. Let's finish this. conduct today was beyond impressive. Facing off against a full-size calamari cruiser with minimal support is no small feat, and you successfully defended the Harpax against their assault until Lord Vader arrived. Harkov's fleet has finally been destroyed, along with the rebel cruiser depriving them of one of their most powerful starships. This would have been a great day for the Empire were it not for Zarin's treachery. If he was bold enough to attack Lord Vader, then he may do the same with the Emperor himself. There is no time to waste, so get to your next briefing. You are to be commended for your efforts today in saving Lord Vader from the treachery of Admiral Zarin. We must now focus our efforts on ensuring the Emperor's safety.